and welcome, I'm Tracy Atkins on location in Pebble Beach, California to introduce a property that may best be described as a French masterpiece set amidst one of the most beautiful natural born galleries imaginable. Otter Cove is an estate of almost two and a half acres in the heart of golfing royalty here in Pebble Beach along the famous 17 mile drive. But despite its illustrious surroundings, this property has managed to carve out a legacy all of its own forged upon a commitment to craftsmanship, heritage, and an unwavering passion for its natural environment. There can be no greater show on earth than that of the natural born cinema. And for those who stand within the beautiful walls of Otter Cove Homestead, it is a show that plays every moment of every day from a miniature marine sanctuary etched into one of the most beautiful stretches of coastline on earth, Pebble Beach. The understanding that Otter Cove is truly unique begins upon arrival, with a journey down a tree-lined drive towards a French Normandy manor house that evokes first a sense of surprise and then of belonging. And fittingly so, on his first visit to the site in 1992, Otto Cove's owner was struck by its uncanny similarity to France's dramatic northwest coastline and so commissioned a home to honour that relationship. To recount the vision behind the creation of this astounding home is to write a love story. Completed in 1997, it was four years in construction and centuries in inspiration. Renowned English-born architect John Mathams engaged to lead a meticulous design journey that saw hand-picked contractors dispatched to France to study the timeless methods of traditional Norman design, all the while assembling a treasure trove of rare materials from around the globe that would become Otto Cove's answer to bricks and mortar. Slate from a ship's ballast, limestone from Burgundy, first growth redwood from Oregon, granite carved from a local hillside, brass, copper, zinc, and more, much, much more. At 9,800 square feet, the home is vast, and yet, as you travel through it, there's a feeling of intimacy, as if able to expand and contract to respond to its occupants' needs and moods. The central courtyard, for instance, has played host to some of Pebble Beach's most elegant and exclusive parties, and yet there could seem no finer place for just one lucky soul to retire with tea and a book to the gentle accompaniment of Otter Fountain. And the courtyard also introduces the aptly named Great Room, a quite magnificent living, dining and entertaining space with limestone floors, ship's rib timber beams, vast stone fireplaces and picture windows. The French doors can be thrown open to evoke a sense of a summer playground or closed down to enjoy the theatre of one of the legendary Monterey storms. The kitchen, an epicurean delight, appointed to the highest level and a beacon any time of day or night, or at the very least, a stopover point from where to grab the glasses before venturing downstairs to the climate-controlled wine room and cellar. From the upstairs level, there is the treat of looking out onto Otto Cove's enchanting roofline, a patchwork quilt of peaks and windows meticulously crafted to replicate the view across the rooftops of an ancient French village. Amidst the array of rooms and amenities on the upper level, the master bedroom suite is possibly the highlight, a sanctuary to rest, retreat, rejuvenate, and from one of the stunning windows, rejoice in the breathtaking spectacle below as otters gather each afternoon to break clams on their bellies and harbour seals arrive each spring to have their pups on the private beach. And all of this flanked by the other wonder of Pebble Beach, its golf courses. Otter Cove tucked into the shoreline in the very heart of Gulf's Holy Grail, sitting directly between the famous lone Cypress and Cypress Point. A place for man, a place for nature, a place for everything and everything in its place. This is the story of Otter Cove, Pebble Beach, California. <laughs>